What's up, guys? It's Enchanted Craft here with 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 Ultra, which is his Ultra, name now. It's, yes. it's no longer Ultra Sword. Um, it's it's Ultra. Anyways, we're gonna be making a Skyblock series. I put a poll in my last video for the Eagle uh, Bed Wars video on whether or not you guys would like to see a Skyblock series, Take and majority of the poll said that yes, indeed, you would like a Skyblock series from me. So I decided to make a co-op. With my friend with Ultra me. Sword over there, yes, and, I am good. And yeah, with with Ultra Sword here. So um, we're gonna we're gonna just quickly build over to the the hub island. Basically, the goal of the series is to harass everything and then get all the armor sets. Very so bad. This is gonna be a lot of work. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but I did have a co-op um, with Peter before, where I basically did everything. I'm not even gonna lie about that. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, right we got now, into the hub right there. Yeah, we're, we we got into the hub as you can see on the map back there And essentially um, this is the map of old skyblock if you guys didn't know although you probably do know already because uh, We, we kind of started it's the series started. pretty late considering when it came out So the first order of business in my opinion would be to because I'm actually smart I'm gonna break all these flowers and then sell them Bro, you can know my flowers yeah, 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 I'm gonna sell them because I'm semi-intelligent. So basically, Skyblock consists. What you're uh, essentially trying to do in Skyblock is unlock recipes in collections. So you're gonna break certain blocks, and every time you break the block, you upgrade your collection. So, uh, Peter, where are you? Okay, you can keep grabbing a few flowers. Cause this, this was, this was how I started last. Um, time I played Skyblock. So I indeed used to play. Well, I do play Skyblock, obviously. But um, you guys probably didn't know about it aside from and people that are, are my friends. So I'm going to the Weaponsmith because he actually has some good starter weapons, undead aka the sword. Undead Sword. Is that good? I don't have enough. I mean, I have enough, so I have the Undead Sword. But anyways, yeah, that's usually the starter weapon. Um, most people think that the Undead Sword is definitely your go-to. Uh, there's also another uh, another good place over here. Where is it? Just listen to Enchanted, guys. <laughs> there's another good place over here <laughs> where you can farm uh, carrots. And carrots, basically, I can sell them as well. And I can get my carrot collection upgraded. Oh, uh, God, it feels so horrible to not have telekinesis. Well, I have a ton of carrots. I'm going to sell them. This is going to get me. Where are your carrots? Where are your carrots? Okay, I went in there. Peter and I uh, later on are going to separate to cover different bases. Um, so I'm going to go mining and he's going to go to the farm. Uh, so I'm going to the to the mines, Peter, and you're going to the um, the farm if you know where it is. If you don't, you can always go to the map and check it. So this is where we're going to separate. Uh, I'm going to go to the mines. If you want to see the farm uh, and the barnyard, Go to Peter's channel and watch his viewpoint of this video yeah, there sure. for the series. Uh, for now, we're going to split up. Uh, I'll see you in a second. Now, so, now, I now. just discovered the coal mine. So, I'm in the coal mines, as I said before. And there's this guy who's in the armor that I'm going to be planning on getting. So, first I'm going to mine some coal, obviously. Because uh, I need to unlock the gold mine. Which is down there. Uh, the reason it says wheat minion recipes is because uh, Peter's currently in the barn or the the farm, whatever you want to call it, and he is collecting wheat and stuff. So, oh, I have a clay trade. That's cool. Oh, uh, Peter's Peter's getting harvesting because it's really easy. There's a ton of wheat there that he can break, and it's like it's not even like it's his is so much easier. If, if I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so basically, yeah, see, I got access to the gold mine, so now I should be able to go down here. I'm just going to mine a couple things as I walk down. And essentially, what my goal here is, is to progress to the deep caverns, which is where we get all the other materials and, um, like, minerals, you know? But here's where I'm trying to go now. It's the coal mines. Um, I mean, the gold mine. Gold mine, sorry. Uh, and this, I think, is where... The gold guy. I don't think he sells. Maybe he sells a gold. No, no, no. He sells the fancy sword. I'm gonna stick with my undead sword because it's better for the mobs that I'm gonna be fighting. So this this guy Rusty here. Um, he's in the gold mines. He gives you the ability to enchant your weapon. 
with telekinesis, which allows you uh, your the items that you mine or the mobs that you kill for the items to automatically go in your inventory as here. Uh, block and mob drops go directly into your inventory. So currently Peter is being a complete boss and he's getting so much stuff right now. Um, but my goal is just going to be uh, getting this stuff. I'm going to have to actually, there's, there's the guy up there that I forgot to talk to. Um, the lazy miner. He, he's, he lost his pickaxe. And it's my job to go find it. Actually, I don't think I've ever been this deep into the gold mines before. Huh. Oh yeah, it's right here. I don't know how or where I just went, but that's where it is. It's It's got smelting touch on it. Promising pickaxe, smelting touch. I don't know which one I want more. Because this other one is going to um, upgrade with its efficiency as I use it to mine things. So if it's combinable, that's cool. But if it's not... Then that's okay. As I can see right now, um, Peter is traveling to the barn. So he's already unlocked the barn, which is pretty crazy. Um, so I don't think, I, I think I'm gonna stick with using the promising pickaxe because it's gonna give me efficiency later. Um, smelting touch isn't as important right now. I mean, it is, but it isn't at the same time. And it doesn't even have telekinesis on it right now because I haven't even changed it yet. But uh, I believe if I find my way back up, if I can, I don't know if I can, if I can <laughs> figure out how to get back up. But when I do, and if I do, I will probably enchant the smelting um, pickaxe with um, with smelt uh, with telekinesis, so that I do not have to keep picking this up. This is kind of annoying. Uh, I'm just gonna assume that the way up is right here, and this is this is the way. So my goal right now is to get to the deep caverns where I'm going to show you guys. It's not really a cheat, but it's a it's an easy way to get down to all of the levels. So if I go check, um, currently my mining level is 2, and I believe it might be mining 3. I'm not sure um, if it's mining 3 or not, but it, I have mining 3 now. It's mining 4. Five. Yeah, it's mining five. So I'm gonna have to get mining five to get into the deep caverns. So I'll get back to you guys when I um, finish mining all this stuff. I'll see ya. And we're back. I'm about to unlock uh, level five mining. So I decided that maybe I'll turn on the recording again. As you can see right there. Yeah, I just got my access to the deep caverns. So if I make my way back up to the um, to the portal, which is at the back once you enter the the uh, gold mine. Um, here's the access point to the deep caverns if you don't already have a portal there. And... Wait a minute. Oh yeah, I do have mining level 5. For a second I was scared that it, it wouldn't work, but it, it did. Um, so I'm actually... I don't know about how this works here, so I think I'm gonna lose money if I fall, which is the strategy, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that. So I understand um, how I was speaking there was a bit confusing. So essentially what I was trying to say is that part of my strategy to uh, unlock all of the sections in the deep caverns requires me to fall into the void, which would take away half of all my coins that are in my purse. So yeah, I'm going to go to the banker who's going to take my money in a good way. Don't worry about it. It's in a good way. Um, so that I don't lose the money when I fall or die. I just deposit my stuff. There we go. So now the rest of it should be all fine and dandy if I go back to the deep caverns, which is a painfully long run, but I'm going to have to do it to make it. So I'm going to just talk to some villagers on the way. Okay, so if we make our way here, I do not have armor, so that is especially why I'm not going down. This guy is psychotic. Uh, I'm going to um, go to the deep caverns and show you a trick that should work. If it doesn't work, cool, I'm going to lose 15 coins. Um, but I will go over to here. I believe it's here. And I'm going to fall down here. Wow, I mean, I didn't make it because I went on fire, but it works. It works. I got, I got most of the way there. 
Yep, I have unlocked all of the um, sanctuary places or all of the mines. So now I can literally just go to the deep caverns guy and um, I can go over here, the lift operator, and I can go down to any level I want. Oh yeah, I can make the farming armor now. Farm, yeah, farming armor, wheat armor. Okay. Let's check, okay. So basically, farming, I'm at farming five right now. And so yeah, changed. Peter's at farming five. Do you want me to make the farming armor? No, that farming armor's bad. Why? But you said we wanted to make all the farming stuff. Well, you all mean the, old armor. All the sets of armor. Yeah, but I mean like dragon sets. Ooh, I see. Oh, die rabbit. Thank you for dying. So I'm doing actually a pretty good amount of damage considering I started like 10 minutes ago. How much damage do you do? I can do 110 on a crit. On a crit? That's I'm about to I die though. I haven't checked yet. I'm gonna go to your place. Cause... Wait, so I'm just trying to max out my farm level, right? I'm gonna go to our island. This guy gave me a full set of miner armor. Dude. So he is actually the nicest person. Chat slash chat a. Thank you so much. Uh, so yeah, that that guy was really nice and gave me miner armor. I now have. Wow. I still have 102 hearts, but I mean, protection five all the way. I'm gonna go so, back to our island because. I I now have a lot better armor. I can actually make it to the other places in this map, but um, my goal was to get Lapis armor, which is, is still, I still have that goal. What is my goal? <laughs> I don't know, Peter, what is your goal? My goal is, I think about what type of armor is made from this. Oh yeah, I realized too that I'm gonna need a diamond pickaxe to mine any obsidian here. Collections, farming collections. So, it's gonna be a bit annoying. Proteins. I'm pretty sure these guys can one tap me. But just in case. <gasps> I'm gonna die in lava. Oh I died. Whatever. I mean if minor armor. This is this is a huge win. So um yeah, I'll get back to you guys once I continue mining and I'm gonna try and grind for lapis armor. So a lot of time passed and I was grinding for a really long time, but I'll let past me say what happened. So this is the end of the video. I officially got lapis armor, which is really good as you can see here. And uh, we did a lot to our island. I honestly, the cut is really, really sharp, but we got a lot of stuff. We were grinding like, okay. The last time you saw me in this video, to me it's been like three, four days, but to you it's been no time at all. But we were grinding. I got all these cobble minions. They're really high leveled. This man is level nine. I'm, yeah, level nine. Like, do, I don't think you understand how much we were grinding. It was painful. But um, in the end, we got this. Uh, I got a lot of cobble minions because I wanted to get super compactors, um, super com compactor three thousands, and uh, yeah. Uh, but I also got grappling hooks, which is actually oh, oh. basically. I think that's that's all I'm gonna do for this episode because. Uh, I've done enough I, I have to say I've done enough because the amount of grinding that I've done so far is I don't I don't know how to explain how much I just did it's it's mind-boggling how much we did it may not look like too much as you can see here it's only like well a level four minion four two minion should be a well it's three and then a level nine but the, the amount of grinding we did oh yeah and uh, I have this I have a stonk Someone donated a stonk to me. I'm like, I mean, I'll take it. Because <laughs> I don't know if any of you guys know what a stonk is, but it breaks things really fast. Also, if you're wondering what texture pack I'm using right now, I'm using uh, Purple's default edit. I'm just going to show you how fast I can break cobble. So, 33 and a stack. That's how much I have. Okay, I mean, it's kind of underwhelming right now because, because of... There's not much space to mine cobble in here, but trust, it's 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 fast. It's fast. Like you can see this. You, 
you saw that. The stonk has efficiency 6 in telekinesis, so it's pretty OP. But yeah, that's that's about it. That's about all I have to say for this video. Um, that That's it, guys. We're, the, we, first episode, it's done. It's, it's done. I got a lot done. Several days worth of grinding that I just accomplished. And I made it to the gold mines. <laughs> Uh, not gold mines, the, the hub island, which is pretty cool. Too bad I can't mine any of this stuff. Like, I can't interact with any of this. See, like, nothing. But I can chill in the hub with no people, which is not um, something a lot of people get to do, usually. So, uh, yeah. I want to check if this portal works, though. It doesn't work. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to see a second episode, show a lot of love and like and subscribe. Also, comment down below if you have any ideas on what you want us to do for this um, series, like goals and other things like that. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll catch you later. Uh, see ya.